Hello. Oh, you made it, you made it. Yes. Good morning. <laughs> Fabulous. You'll see why at the end. Right. Fabulous. Brian, looking sharp today. Uh, first and foremost, yes. the Teacher of the Year is a, a, a huge honor because we have so many fabulous teachers at Northport High School. I think I was selected uh, number one for the courses that I teach, for my enthusiasm, and third and most importantly, I feel for my passion in which I teach it. I'm able to convey difficult concepts to students in a fun way, and the students are receptive to that. Um, right here. Nasal is right here. Coach C is very motivating and she also uses a lot of different learning techniques that a lot of other teachers don't use and uh, if she was probably the best candidate this year for teacher of the year in my opinion. Not everybody gets to do that, right? The patient's family doesn't get to do that. I would have done the same thing. I mean, she definitely deserves it. She stays, you know, after school anytime anybody needs help or anything like that. She's always there, she's very energetic, um, always is taking the time to make sure that we learn and that we are understanding what's you know, being said and what's being taught. She does a variety of different um, learning, uh, you know, like she will sometimes, maybe we'll just be reading out of the book or even like today we'll be doing a hands-on activity or sometimes we even go outside and um, you know, do with the whole class, learn about uh, blood cells and things like that. The yes. Okay. okay, here everything in yellow is occipital bone. It when she teaches, she Magnum. gets people's attention and she wants like you to learn stuff and people are more like the way she does it, like affirmative and you know, she wants Where's people to understand and she'll help whatever she needs. Like if you need help with or if you have any questions, she has no problem answering. You can just ask, feel free. It's a very comfortable environment in this classroom. There's a little crack that outlines it. And it's my and first year with her. I've heard a lot of good things over the year, like, you gotta take this class, you gotta take this class, or you gotta take it. I mean, it's yeah, it's hard, but you know what? It pays off in the end because in, in the overall, she she mostly got picked because her energy she brings. Like, I've, right I've come in, I've come in, like, ready to go during the day. She's right there, she's got the lesson planned, all planned out. She knows, all right, we're gonna do this for 10 minutes, this, 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 and we're gonna go right through it. We're gonna ch chug right along, and before you know it, you're done with the chapter, and you've already taken your test, you've got 100 or whatever, and she just, she's got the drive to make sure to push you. Like, some kids walk in, like, well, they, they might not want to be here, and then by the end, they're like, wow, this, this, is, this is a good class. Lacrimal fossa, and then there's an opening. On here, it's been casted over, so here's one where this skull isn't as good as this skull, vice versa. I wake up before my alarm goes off, so I'm excited initially, and I try to share that excitement with my students uh, in shedding the light, uh, showing them how to see things differently. We change their vision with this course and we provide a lot of models, visuals, and uh, opportunities for them to really understand the content fully. They gain confidence with that and they go on to college and write us back here at Northport High School and say how much the course meant to them when they move on. She has a lot of energy. She brings a lot of energy to the learning and it's a really good atmosphere to be learning in and it's fun too. And I laminated it. And so, like, I like. How did you laminate? You have a laminator yeah. at home? Yeah. And then I just. <laughs> my mom is very artsy. So. I love coming to this class. I, I fourth period. I, I definitely. I enjoy coming to this class. I learn more here in 50 minutes than I probably do anywhere else in any other class. I mean, I learn so much, and it's very. I recommend this class to anybody. Yeah. Okay. Anyway. Is inside behind. She keeps us doing activities, so it's like she makes us want to have fun and not just, you know, boring lesson, just, just talking or listening or taking notes, um, which is, I feel, a lot better than most classes, which she does. It's more hands-on and activity, so it's, you know, you learn better for some people, maybe not, but you have your own way of studying or testing and whatever you feel best fits you. Say that one again. Yes. I've learned so much because when I first started up. I had a, I had a high B in my first quarter, and then stay, her staying at like 
giving me extra time and like helping me figure out more ways to like pair up certain things and remember it. It's definitely paid off though. Yeah, I would, I'm very glad to have a teacher like Co Coach Caracciolo. There you go. Absolutely. I love this job. I left professional soccer to teach. Uh, and I never looked back. I was playing for the Tampa Bay Extreme. And um, I never regretted leaving professional soccer to teach. Not once, not one day. I absolutely love this job. I love our students. Um, I love the content that I teach. And overall, it is a positive experience day in and day out. Perpendicular the All right. There we go. <laughs> <laughs> it came back to you. 100%. 100%, Joel. Great job.